and court. If people are in the foothills or the mountains or places like Red Bluff, places where snow is falling in Redding, best place to be is right in their living room watching us on TV. That's right. And if you do need to head out and about, make sure that you're doing so early today. You want to give yourself plenty of extra time. Roads are slick. It is tough to see out there. Visibility in the northern end of the valley is under a mile right now between Redding and Red Bluff at 5:30 a.m. We are going to be seeing more snowfall on the way for our lower elevations, especially early today. And here is a live look outside at the Sundial Bridge in Redding. You can see in this video there is still snow falling right now and it is collecting along the Sundial Bridge and just off the bridge as well. Temperatures right now 30s in the valley to low 40s. We're in the 20s to 30s in the foothills and 20s in our mountain zones. Winter storm warnings remaining in effect through noon today in the valley, 1 p.m. today in the northern mountains, 4 a.m. Saturday for the northern Sierra, and wind advisory for Butte and Glen County Valley areas to the south through 4 p.m. today for potential for gusts up to around the 30 to 40 mile an hour range. Now right now sustained winds up to around 15 to 16 miles an hour out of the southeast in the mid valley. Midday this is already starting to drop off a little bit so it looks like that advisory may be lifted. Saturday winds are still fairly modest and Saturday is the one day where you're getting that break from the active weather but then Sunday another storm system rolls in kicking those winds back up 30 to 40 mile an hour gusts through the day Sunday with more rain and snow heading through. Right now here's what I'm tracking for you. Snowfall across the valley floor in the Shasta County area. You can see Redding as well as Anderson, Cottonwood all getting snow. Red Bluff getting snow into Hama County right now. It's been a mix of rain and snow in Corning. Most of that on the west side of Corning. Los Molinos starting to see snow getting a little closer. Orland getting a bit of snow right now. Willows, it's a mix of rain and snow, but the main band is just north of Willows. And you can see it's mostly rain in the valley for Butte County right now. Orville almost seeing that snowfall. It's at the upper edge of Lake Orville and in the Butte County foothills well below Paradise. So on that turn that you go up Highway 32 as you're heading towards, say, Chester, it is snowing just above that turn right now. Low pressure off the coast tracking south is bringing snow, windy conditions, showers, as well as cooler temperatures to your forecast today and your hyperlocal futurecast showing you 6 a.m. Snow in the North Valley and the west side of the valley getting closer to Chico, 7 to 8 a.m. That's when it looks like the best bet is for snowfall in Chico and potentially Orville as well. But snow levels starting to lift by around 11 a.m. to noon, starting to decrease across the Hama and Shasta counties for the valley. And then we do see more scattered showers for your afternoon commute home, but most of that wraps up tonight. We're dry through the day on Saturday, but another wet system arriving late Sunday into early Monday. That'll bring rain and snow, but snow levels won't be as low Sunday. Monday night into Tuesday, snow levels drop potentially down to the valley floor in Redding, but it's rain for the rest of the valley with snow in the foothills and mountains. Continuing to see rain and snow Tuesday, that fizzles out by the middle of next week with more rain chances next weekend. So how much rain is left from this system today? It looks like a little over a half an inch for most of the valley, half an inch to an inch in some of our mountain zones. As we head through Sunday and through the middle of next week, we're looking at over an inch and a half possible, putting our totals up to close to two inches in the valley, upwards of three to potentially four inches in some mountain zones. Looks like we could see a dusting of snow in Chico. I don't see, think we're seeing three inches, but Redding could potentially get four to three inches more, as could Red Bluff. Another foot of snow for our higher elevations as well. Sunday, that next system bringing a couple feet of snow through Tuesday of next week in the northern Sierra. It is going to be an absolute downpour early next week. 30s for the most part in the northern mountains, 20s to 30s in the Sierra and southern Cascades, foothills in the 30s to low 40s today. And if you're in the valley, temperatures mid 40s for your afternoon. Snow in the morning, rain showers late in the day. Chico it looks like some flurries early on today, as is Orville. Orland and Willow is a better chance for those snow showers early and then it's rain showers for the remainder of your Friday. We'll be drying out and warming up a little bit Saturday with clearing skies, lower to mid 50s in the valley, then dipping back into the mid 40s with more showers on the way Sunday. Heavier rain and the chance for thunderstorms Tuesday with a chance for valley snow and redding Monday night into Tuesday morning. And then again, we will be drying out through the middle of next week with more shower chances ahead for next weekend.